life is often compared to a playground. A place of joy, discovery, exploration and maybe even a scraped knee or two. But unlike the carefully constructed equipment, monitored schoolyard and watchful eyes of a real playground, life is a messy, somewhat, unpredictable affair. And one of the first truths we learn, often the hard way, the harsh reality is that this playground isn't fair at all. This lack of fairness can be a bitter pill to swallow, but accepting it can be the first step towards navigating its uneven terrain. We grow up believing in a certain cosmic balance. Hard work equals reward, good deeds deserve good fortune. But the world operates on its own chaotic system. Sometimes, the talented get sidelined by injury, while others stumble into success. Kindness can be met with indifference, and tragedy can strike the undeserving. This inherent unfairness, that we the vast majority of people, get forced to live in, this cosmic labor camp, can be a very bitter pill to swallow. We all crave fairness. It's a deeply human desire, a sense that good deeds are rewarded and hardships find solace. We all grow up on stories, radio and TV shows, that teach, the fairy tale that, good deeds are rewarded, we as little kids, believe them. Yet, the world operates on a different system. Luck plays an undeniable role. Some are born with advantages financial security, strong connections, and good health, while others face seemingly insurmountable obstacles from the outset. Natural disasters strike with brutal impartiality and tragedies can befall the undeserving. This inherent unfairness can breed frustration, anger and a sense of helplessness. However, accepting this reality isn't about succumbing to cynicism. It's about shedding the illusion of control and embracing the power of resilience. Dwelling on what should be fair only breeds resentment and is a recipe for misery instead, we must shift our focus, we can choose to focus on what we can control, our attitude, our actions and how we respond to the curveballs life throws. Life may not be fair, for all, all the time, but it offers incredible opportunities for growth and resilience. When faced with setbacks, we can choose to wallow or we can choose to rise. We can use the unfairness as fuel, a motivator to push harder, to work smarter, to overcome the odds. History is filled with examples of those who defied the odds. From the underprivileged artist who climbed the social ladder through sheer talent, to the scientist who battled a debilitating illness to make groundbreaking discoveries, the human spirit has a remarkable capacity to rise above circumstance. Folks, this doesn't mean giving up on fighting for justice or creating a more equitable world. It simply means understanding that fairness is an ideal we strive for, not a guarantee. It also means acknowledging that life doesn't always follow a predictable script, if you are a commoner, or a member of the working class, because life's local planetary scripts are, crafted by the ruling elites, this planet's movers and shakers. So expect that, it throws curveballs, some devastating, some simply inconvenient. When faced with an unfair situation, we can choose to channel our frustration into positive action. We can advocate for change, contact our representatives, go to town hall meetings, use social media, go raise, your voice in organized protests, support those less fortunate and build a community that values empathy and compassion. Life's unfairness can also be a catalyst for growth. It forces us to adapt, persevere and discover reserves of strength we never knew we possessed. Overcoming challenges builds character and teaches us valuable lessons about ourselves and the world. Learning to adapt, to find the silver linings and above all, to keep moving forward. The knowledge that life isn't fair is a form of liberation. It frees us from the shackles of resentment and empowers us to focus on what truly matters. We can learn to appreciate the good times more intensely, knowing they might not last. We can develop grit and determination, knowing that success rarely comes easy. And perhaps most importantly, we can cultivate compassion, understanding that everyone, ourselves included, is playing on the same uneven playing field. So, the next time life throws you a curveball, remember, 
it's not always a sign that the game is rigged. It's simply an invitation to play with more heart, more resilience, choose growth, and choose to write your own story and with a clear understanding of the rules, life may not be fair, but it's a dog-eat-dog, -dog, game worth playing nonetheless. Please, tell me what you think, and how you feel about this issue. Analyze it, brainstorm it, debate it and if you like it, share it. Thank you for watching, I appreciate you, and God bless you.